Drifters is a Japanese shonen manga series turned animated television series written and illustrated by Kuda Hirano, published on April 30th of 2009 through Shonen Gashusha magazine Young King Hours. The manga was adapted into an anime by the Japanese animation studio Hoods Entertainment on October 7th, 2016. Something's burning. Written and illustrated by the Japanese manga artist Kuda Hiron, most famous for a supernatural action-based vampiric teacher, manga series titled favorites. Helsing, uh, the Drifters uh, manga was published uh, on April 30th really of 2009 uh, through the Japanese monthly sign-in magazine uh, Young uh, King uh, Hours, the sister uh, publication uh, of Young King. Uh, While the manga series uh, is serialized uh, in Shonen Gashin's uh, Young King uh, Hours uh, magazine uh, and sold under the same publisher in Japan, the series is licensed in the Western market by the American comic book and manga manga publisher Dark Horse Comics, in France by the French manga publisher Tonkam, in Germany by the Italian comic book publisher Panini Comics, in Italy by the Italian publisher J-Pop, in Taiwan by Tong Li Publishing, and in Poland by Japonica Polonica Fantastica. As of September of 2020, the now 79 chapters have been collected into six Tankabon volumes, the Japanese term for a book that's not part of a series since the first volumes were released in Japan on July 7th of 2010. According to Singanen's page in the Drifters' original artwork display event done in celebration of the 450 years since the death of Sengoku period samurai Shimatsu Toshihisha, the Drifters manga has sold well over 1.5 million copies worldwide in five different languages. of dead men. Originally premiering in Tokyo, Japan on the independent television station Tokyo MX, the animation adaptation of the series first started as a 150 second long animation short bundled with the 10th and final volume of the Helsing Ultimate. The short was supervised by Helsing Ultimate's chief animation director Ryoji Nakamori with veteran animators Kazuya Miura as technical director and Masayori Komine as animation director. Before airing its first episode on October 7th of 2016, the anime adaptation was announced to be in the works in the May 2015 issue of Young King Hours. The animation series is directed by Kenshi Suzuki, produced by NBC Universal Entertainment Japan, animated by Hoods Entertainment, written by both Hiduki Kurata and Yosuke Kuroda, and features character designs by Ryoji Nakamon. Airing for 12 episodes in its first season, a 13th to the 14th episode was announced on October 10th of 2017 to be on Blu-ray discs in regular and limited edition versions, released on December 23rd of 2017 with a 15-episode bundle with a special edition of the manga's sixth volume on November 30th of 2018. A specially edited version of the first and second episodes was bundled with the manga's fifth volume and was released on June 6 of 2018. The DVD contained 36 minutes worth of video which showed the same animation with different narration. On December 30th of 2016, a special limited edition Blu-ray box set was released with all 12 episodes with added unaired footage, an exclusive box cover illustrated by Drifter's illustrator and writer Kuda Hirano, a 200-page animation sketch collection by Chief Animation Director Ryoji Nakamori, a 52-page booklet, a bonus extras disc, and a two-CD original soundtrack that contained an extra titled Koku Sama Go Ration and promotional videos. Those who pre-ordered this box set before November 6 of 2016 received an exclusive illustration card set. The limited edition version of the Blu-ray box set released on December 23rd of 2017 mentioned earlier included an outer case illustrated by manga creator Kuda Hirano, a jacket illustrated by character designer and chief animation director Ryoji Nakamori, a bonus video, a drama CD, a 72-page booklet, and a mystery disc. In Japan, the anime is exclusively streamed on the Japanese video streaming website Albima TV at the same time it aired on television on October 7th of 2016. Both Funimation and Crunchyroll streamed Drifters in English beginning on November 6th of 2016. 
At the end of the anime's 12th and final episode of season 1, a second season was announced with the message, See you again, Tokyo 20XX. Due to a lack of content in terms of how many volumes exist, the second season shouldn't be expected anytime soon despite the show being renewed for a second season in 2016. The story itself has a rather simple yet equally as engaging premise. The world of Drifters is much like our own, except the world is inhabited by a number of fantastical races, including elves, dwarves, and hobbits, as well as humans. In this world of fantastical beings, a war rages on between two groups known as the Ends and the Drifters. The Drifters are a group of heroes, leaders, and great warriors from different cultures and eras and time brought together to this fantasy world by a mysterious man named Murasaki who uses them as a means to right the wrongs of the end's conquest of the magical world. A common element between these Drifters is their intolerance towards the hurting and butchering of innocence, although being driven themselves by violence, victory, and conquest. The Ends are the primary antagonists of the series and are a group mainly composed of powerful historical figures who died under unorthodox and often violent circumstances brought to this new world by an arrogant and short-tempered young woman named Easy, who is at odds with Murasaki. Also unlike the Drifters who possess their natural born strength, the Ends have supernatural abilities which largely appear to be related to how they died and or the events leading up to their deaths. So good and I kept going with it and I really like it and um, Yoichi is like my favorite character so far. The butchered bodies will mix with the grass, dirt, piss, and shit. The drifters are composed of Shimazu Toshihisha, son of Shimazu Aisha and nephew of Shimazu Yoshihiro, was a Japanese samurai and member of the Shimazu clan who historically died in 1600 at the Battle of Sekigahara. However, in the Drifters' history, Shimazu is transported to a fantasy world after being critically injured at the Battle of Sekigahara, only to be saved by two elven children who bring him to two other Drifters, Nobunga and Yoichi, who help bandage his wounds. Shimazu sports a nodachi, a traditional Japanese sword used by samurai, a wazizashi, another traditional Japanese sword used by samurai in feudal Japan, and a tanigashima, a type of matchlock long gun, at his waist. Oda Nobunga was a powerful Japanese lord during the Sengoku period who acted as head of the powerful Oda clan and launched a war against other samurai in order to unify Japan in the 1560s who historically died in 1582 during the Honoji incident. However, in the Drifters' history, Oda is transported to the fantastical world of Drifters six months prior to the beginning of the series. Unlike Shimazu, who uses his matchlock sparingly, Oda sports an Akubus, a type of matchlock hook gun. Nasu Noichi was a samurai who fought alongside the Minamoto clan in the Genpai War, and is particularly famous from his actions at the Battle of Ashima, told by the tale of Hike, where the enemy Taira clan placed a fan atop a pole on one of their ships, daring the Minamoto warriors to shoot it off, which Nasu, atop his horse, shot it down with only one shot. Unlike other drifters who have died in our world only to be brought to the fantastical world of drifters before meeting their untimely demise, most believe that Nasu died at the age of 64 in the year 1232. Despite this, Nasu has nevertheless been brought to this world and fights alongside Oda and Chimazu as the group's archer, killing fleeing enemies. Hannibal Barca was a Carthaginian general and statesman who commanded Carthage's main forces against the Roman Republic during the Second Punic War, who historically died sometime between 183 and 181 BC in the ancient town of Lablacia after being betrayed to the Romans. However, in the Drifters' history, Hannibal has been transported to the fantastical world of Drifters as a now elderly and later on senile old man who is still more than capable of constructing articulate battle tactics. Scipio Africanus was a Roman general and later consul, a title given to one of the two chief magistrates of the Roman Republic, who is best known for defeating Hannibal at the Battle of Zama, which marked the end of the Second Punic War. 
Scipio also died sometime between 183 and 181 BC, either by the lingering effects of the fever contracted during a campaign in 190 BC or by his own hands. However, in the Drifters' history, Scipio has also been transported to the fantastical world of Drifters, seemingly alongside Hannibal. Butch Cassidy was an American train and bank robber who acted as leader of the Wild Bunch, a loosely organized outlaw gang from the Old West era of the United States, and is believed to have met his end in the shootout with the Bolivian army in November of 1908 alongside his accomplice, Harry Alonzo Longabao, known as the Sundance Kid. In the Drifter's history, Butch was transported before his death in Bolivia alongside his partner in crime to fight the end. Like Oda, Butch favors the use of firearms and sports a set of revolvers in battle. Harry Alonzo Longabao, known as the Sundance Kid, was an outlaw of the American Old West and member of Butch Cassidy's Wild Bunch gang, who helped them perform the longest string of successful train and bank robberies in American history before meeting his demise alongside Cassidy during a shootout with the Bolivian Army in November of 1908. As mentioned before, the Sundance Kid was transported from Bolivia to the world of the Drifters series alongside his partner in crime, Butch Cassidy. Unlike his partner, who has a hot-blooded and wild personality, Longabao possesses a calm and collected personality. Similarly to his partner, Longabao favors firearms, which shows a particular taste in shotguns and gatling guns. Naoshi Kano was the Second World War Japanese fighter ace, a title given to military aviators credited with shooting down five or more enemy aircraft during aerial combat, who was credited with 25 confirmed kills, who acted as leader of the Sento 306 Heikotai S-306 starting on September 25th of 1944. Although his remains were never found after a mission on August 1st of 1945 where he took off to intercept a group of B-24 bombers and sustained significant damage when a barrel of his gun exploded, his crash was considered his demise. In the world of Drifters, Naoshi was transported during a battle between the Inn and the Orta Empire where he helped take down numerous enemy combatants and dragons after having memories of the bombing of Tokyo triggered him. Tamon Yamaguchi was a rear admiral in the Imperial Japanese Navy who served during the Second Sino-Japanese War and the Pacific War during the Second World War before meeting his end at the Battle of Midway, during which he chose to go down with his ship, the Hiru, after having it crippled by the U.S. Enterprise and subsequently scuttled. Like Naoshi, who was transported with his aircraft, Tamon was transported to the world of the Drifters alongside his aircraft carrier and formed an uneasy alliance with the leaders of Gu Binan, a merchant guild fighting against the Orta Empire by acting as leader of their naval forces. The gloves with which he holds the paper indicate that he's somewhat fastidious. <laughs> Please, let us go. Please, I don't want to die. Spare me. The ends are composed of the Black King, believed by many to be Jesus, acts as the leader of the ends and possesses both healing powers and the ability to multiply any life form he pleases, such as food and wood. The theory that he's Jesus is based on the puncture scars of both of his palms and his claim that he once tried to, quote, save humans, but he has since shifted his agenda towards non-humans after having his efforts, quote, denied by humans. Hijigata Toshizo was a Japanese warrior who served as vice commander of the Shinsungumi, a special police force organized by the Gakufu during the Bakumatsu period, who resisted the Meiji Restoration before meeting his end on June 20th of 1869 while leading his troops on horseback near the Ipongongi Kanmon after a bullet shattered his lower back. In the world of Drifters, Hijigata has the ability to use smoke to manifest ghostly images of members of the Shinzugumi who he uses to cut apart his enemies. Joanne of Arc, nicknamed the Maid of Orleans, is a heroine of France who was a key member in the recovery of France from English domination late in the Hundred Years' War by Charles VII and gained prominence at the Siege of Orleans after the siege was lifted only nine days later. This victory and several others led to Charles VII's consecration at Reims and paved the way to the final French victory. She met her brutal end after being captured on the 23rd of May of 1430 by the Burgundian faction and handed over over to the English and subsequently put on trial by the pro-English bishop Pierre Cachon, only to be burned at the stake on May 30th at age 19. In the world of Drifters, Joanne has the ability to manipulate fire. 
Giles de Rey was a knight and lord of the Duchy of Brittany, Anjou, and Poitou, who acted as leader of the French army and a companion in arms to Joanne of Arc, who was famously convicted for a string of child murders which some to believe false and that he was in fact a victim of the Inquisition. Although historically being hung and burned publicly on the Wednesday of October 26 at 9 o'clock, in the world of drifters he acts as a protector of Joanne, as a spearman who possesses incredible strength and endurance. Anastasia Naklova was the youngest daughter of Tsar Nicholas II, the last sovereign of Imperial Russia, who met a brutal end alongside her family at the hands of a group of Bluffschitz assassins on July 17th of 1918 at the age of 17. Depicted as an emotionless woman with little interest in the war between the ends and drifters, Anastasia in the world of drifters possesses the ability to create blizzards at will. Grigory Rasputin was a Russian mystic and self-proclaimed holy man who gained considerable influence in late Imperial Russia after becoming friends with the family of Nicholas II, the last emperor of Russia, whose death is a complicated one. According to a book written by Douglas Smith titled Rasputin, Faith, Power, and the Twilight of the Romanovs, the right-wing politician Vladimir Pushkov supposedly bragged to two soldiers that he had killed Rasputin and later explained to police that he had fed Rasputin several things laced with poison to no effect before shooting him twice in the chest before Rasputin arose again to which he shot him a third time and later threw him into Little Nevka. In the world of drifters, Rasputin serves as a spy master for the Black King. Akechi Mitsuhide was a Japanese samurai general of the Sengoku period who acted as a bodyguard for the final shogun, Ashigaka Yoshiki, before becoming a general under Oba Nobunga during his war of political unification in Japan, only to later assassinate Oda for unknown reasons during the Honoji incident of 1582. Historically, Akichi was pursued by Oda's successor before being killed by the bandit peasant Nakamura Shobai. In the world of drifters where both Oda and Akichi remain alive, Akichi thirsts to kill Nobunga during the war between the drifters and the ends. Minamoto no Yuchisune was a military commander of the Minamoto clan of Japan in late Heian and early Kamakura periods who led a series of battles which toppled the Isiheishi branch of the Taira clan and never helped his brother Yoritomo consolidate power. Yoshisume met his end at the end of a blade by Fujiwara no Hidehira, who gave in the pressure from Yoritomo and forced Yoshisune to commit seppuku after defeating Yoshisune's men, only to later preserve his head in sake and a black lacquer chest to send to Yoritomo as proof of his death. Unlike the other ends, Yoshisume's status as a drifter or an end is unknown, and he often remarks that he will go to the side that provides him with the most amusement. Commercial. It's just a roll of the dice. Like, I, I've, I've been... Voila, you elegant little Arla Queen. Despite having little content to be viewed slash read in comparison to other anime, Drifters has been nominated twice for the annual manga Taisho Awards in both 2011 and 2012. In a 2015 survey by the Japanese website Anime Anime, Drifters won 5th place among top 10 manga properties like One Punch Man and Soul Catchers to have an animated adaptation. The manga is also well received among critics like Gabriel Vega from Bafas, who says, quote, The action paces itself throughout the volume, making sure to include only enough to keep readers moving quickly through the event until the next transition hits in a review on the first volume of the series. Writers for Crunchyroll, like Peter Phobian, have also noted Drifters has all but jumped the shark by belligerently knocking over all of the narrative pillars of the isekai genre. The news and media website Inquisitor made a similar statement, writing that, quote, anime fans have been treated to a steady stream of the isekai subgenre, but Drifters pretty much turns our expectations on its head. recognize a goddamn end to this terrain. Thank you for watching. My name is Jacko, and if you want to know more about me, check out my Twitter, Jacko-2026. If you want to watch the show in its entirety for yourself, as well as read and watch the additional content related to the series, you can find the links to everything mentioned in both the description and pinned comment below. Make sure to hit subscribe and that like button below if you enjoyed the video, as well as leave a comment as to which anime or movie series you'd like us to cover in a future video. 
If you enjoyed this video and would like to not only see them continue, but improve in quality, consider supporting us on Patreon or Ko-Fi. Links in the description below. Yeah,